uh, it's kind of surreal. Um, you know, you go from playing in the spring and you're used to this long layoff, you know, in a typical year, but with COVID, we had a quick turnaround. Um, and it's just incredible to have the group back. And, you know, we told the group yesterday, we just feel like we have so much more purpose uh, when they're back here on campus. We, we feel really good about the, the leadership that we have in our upperclassmen. We feel really good about the veterans that we have in our group. Um, they've been through a few cycles with us now, so they know what our expectations are. And um, from what we've seen so far, the freshmen have come in and they've, uh, you know, they've kind of fallen right in line with what we expect from our upperclassmen. So we're really proud of that. And well, first and foremost, I think we play in one of the most competitive regions in the country. Um, you know, we tell any player that we're looking at or any player that's here that we want to play a competitive schedule, not just to help us prepare for the, for the conference ske uh, schedule, but, you know, we want to play the best teams in the country. And I think that, you know, any players nowadays, they want to compete against the best and they want to, you know, they want to compete at a high level. And we're, we're fortunate enough to be in a region of the country where we can schedule a really competitive schedule. I, I think we made a lot of growth last year in terms of what we wanted our identity to be on the field. Um, you know, I think every team takes on a different life of its own, so we really want to emphasize kind of this group becoming its own thing culture-wise inside the locker room and off the field. Um, but as far as being on the field, we just want our guys to embrace, you know, trying to play an identity and a brand that's a little different maybe, um, you know, and just emphasizing kind of growing on our team shape and some of the things that we, you know, I thought we did a good job of producing last year. Yeah, man, coming off a knee injury and just excited to be here, excited, blessed for this opportunity to play soccer again. Um, I think all around, just the freshmen coming in, they're going to bring, you know, they're going to bring a little bit of everything to the to what we already had from last year, so we, we can build on that and, and really grow as a team. Yeah, just just act as leaders, man, and just just be there for the freshmen whenever they need us, and uh, yeah, just just be there for them. Yeah, um, we obviously we've lost a couple of players, and Adrian was one of the leaders as well. But I just want to sort of get on the field, make more of an impact in terms of goals, assists, overall leadership on the field, and just sort of get more returns on goal, got goals and assists. Man. I think just leading by example, come out on the field every day ready to train, ready to get out, um, good energy, positivity and just sort of get everyone comfortable in the, in the environment and just get them ready to go for conference, long conference. I think as a team, we've had a lot of like growth over the last few years. I think we've been this close, it feels like, for the last two years. And it's just been those little blocks, those little missing pieces that we've got from the freshmen coming in, hopefully. We've had a lot of close results, we've lost a lot of games by one goal, and just been late goals mistakes and stuff like that have cost us so hopefully this is the year where we can turn it around, piece it all together and sort of fix the, fix the last piece of the puzzle. Well, I think the biggest thing is having that brotherhood on and off the field. Um, I think it carries on what you do off the field, you'll see it on the field and I think from last season is being turned on all 90 minutes and not taking a playoff, having no passive individuals and having every single individual in the locker room act as a leader. So I think last year we had a lot of freshmen take the field so I think they gained a lot of experience that they can uh, part wisdom into the freshmen and I think the biggest thing is just teach the, the freshmen the culture of the program which I think we learned last year that we lack that and we just need that confidence and just stick positive throughout the whole season. No, it's exciting man. We've been looking forward to it all summer. We've been in contact through social media, through Zooms and just seeing each other face to face, getting COVID behind our back and just being back on the field together as a family and we're ready to take the field on Sunday.